today I'm going to be continuing Disney's Heroes Battle Mode. So today we're starting in the Coliseum, which is unusual for me because this is not my best place. I'm still trying to figure out the Coliseum. Uh, but anyways, here we are, and let's go ahead and try and see if we can match up some of the heroes to battle here. This person doesn't seem very difficult. Uh, I think this one might be my toughest challenge. So what can I do to switch things around? Uh, this is where I always run into some problems. So I'm like, I don't know what to do. All right, so let's go ahead and get rid of we got rid of Eve off the team and then added ooh that's too close way too close uh... let's add take Frozone off add him in the first squad and then put Eve on the second one and the third one should be totally fine alright Let's go ahead and see if I match things up, okay? Because sometimes even when I match the uh, powers and stuff like that, for whatever reason, if they can heal and stuff like that, then they'll, the other team can still win. Um, so I have to make sure that I have somebody on the team that can heal as well. So, Jazzy's kicked out. Oh, that's bad. Oh my, am I gonna lose this? Did I make a mistake? <laughs> okay, so yeah, evolve Judy Hops. Okay, can we actually do that? We can. I should have thought of that first. All right, so let's go ahead and um, how much is this gonna cost? Thirty-five thousand. So not too bad. So today we're evolving Judy Hops that we should have done before we went into the Coliseum and check out her stats. They are amazing now. Yay! She's gotten a lot stronger. So she is now a two star. So I'll need 50 uh, chips for her again in order to get her to a three star. So this is actually super impressive. I'm really happy with this. So where did that put Judy in the whole scheme of things? There. Uh, so she's, she's really moved up. This is amazing. Um, I'm really happy with this. Okay. So now I'm gonna go ahead into crates. I love opening crates. And we're gonna open a free gold crate. And we got golden flower plan. I wonder if we'll ever see any Disney princesses in this game. What do you guys think? What if we were to see like uh, Jasmine and Cinderella? I mean, we've got Vanellope, who's a Disney princess in here already. But um, I mean, she's really the only one if we're talking princesses, at least on my team. Um, in the whole game, I don't really see anybody else. Yeah, so that's it. Um, I am collecting for Sally. I love, love, love Sally. If I could guarantee that I was going to get another set of chips for her, I would definitely go ahead and uh, buy another one with gems. But I'm not going to. But in the last video, I had a whole bunch of free crates, free um, diamond crates to open. And I actually got some Sally chips, which was amazing. Check out some of her animations here. They're so cool. Oh, amazing. So the, this was part of the patch notes and stuff like that um, that are part of Disney's Heroes Battle Modes right now. So um if you guys haven't read the patch notes i highly recommend it there's a lot of really good info in there and stuff like that on what they've done with the update so the nightmare before christmas i'll just give you a little little bit of info so the nightmare before christmas is now in the game um only jack skellington and sally that i've seen um i think it would be cool if we added um you know oogie boogie in here that would be cool um i haven't seen him though i don't know if he's actually new up here and also uh, the mayor would be kind of cool as well so we'll just sort of have to wait and see if that's something that they do in the future so now it's time to go into the arena and we'll see here uh, little fluff can fight that's me by the way little fluff <laughs> can fight jackson warriors so i am stronger so i should win this battle but we'll go ahead and give it a go It looks like I won! 
<laughs> Victory! Sweet. Super happy about that. Okay, now, today I'm not going to do City Watch. I am going to go into the campaigns here. And part of the challenges that I have right now, actually, is to collect more Nick Wild chips. So I have to be able to get 20 in a week. So seven days I have to finish this. So I haven't been doing very well at this. I've tried this challenge a few times. I haven't had enough luck with it. Um, but hopefully this time around I will be able to. And it just is in the elite campaign. It's not like if he appears in the market, they, the chips won't get added to your, uh, to your challenge score. So it's really just an elite, and I don't know if he appears later on in the chapter. If you guys know, you can always let me know in the comments. Um, otherwise, basically, it's just like, I just basically have one chapter, and I think it's like three different sections I can use to battle with him, so. All right, so nothing there. So, yeah, so we've got two more that I can do right now, so let's go ahead and do that. We do get three tries, though, per section, so... Um, that is good, but I wish we would get like five attempts, even if it would use a lot of the energy canisters to battle. In the normal campaign mode, I'd be okay with that, um, if we just could use all of the energy on that. On like five battles, five attempts anyways. It doesn't mean I have to give us chips every time, but a little bit more frequently would be good. <laughs> this is making this challenge super hard. No, oh, I think we got one actually. I think I just saw it fly into the crate and I did. Yay! Sweet. Let's rerun that. I wonder what I'm at now. Maybe like four? Four, five? I'll have to check after I complete all of these battles here. Wild chips. Not yet, anyways. luck. What was that? Was that the black market that was just found? If it was, then uh, I need to go and check that after this too. So I've got two things to do after these next three battles here. It should be like every other time you battle, you get chips. Instead of like every like three or four times you battle, you get chips. <laughs> it would just make it a little bit funner. It sometimes it's like that with now with the badges too. It's like you get badges, but you have to go through so many battles to try and get the badge, and it's I don't know, it's not as fun. But there is the Nick Wild chip that I was hoping for. Yeah, some of the badges now to promote the heroes is crazy. I know saving for gold is crazy too, but realistically, um, I'd rather be saving for gold and stuff like that. 
or even purchase it with real money rather than uh, go ahead and try and continuously battle for badges. I don't know, it's not as fun for me. Victory! Whoa, we got lots of stuff, but not what we were trying to get. And now I have run all my courses for Nick Wild Chip. So that is it. Um, now, in the challenges here, we'll see how many I have now. I've got 6 of 20. Actually, this is not too bad, guys, considering. Um, I mean, normally I get to like 10 or 11 chips for the whole week, and that's all I get. So I'm at 6 already, and it's like hasn't even been a full day yet. So that's, well, technically it'll be two full days because um, it won't refresh again, but that isn't, that isn't bad. Now... Uh, I didn't I thought I saw the black market, but maybe I was wrong. I thought it came up. Oh, Mega Mart. Um Finnick chips? I don't know. I'm not like super fond of Finnick, but I am of the light bleed plan bit. Yes, yes, yes. What is this? Eve needs this for crafting. Ooh. 100 gems. Okay, fine, I'll do it. I don't have enough for this, but my heroes need it. Alright, so there we go. Um, now there's two slots at the bottom. Unlock more item slots with guild perks. So, wow, I need to get a lot more of these, but you know what? That's okay. Speaking of the guild, let's go in here and check in for the day. So I do get some of the perks. Um, and now we'll, oh, I've still got my mercenaries sent out. Um, I can still use these heroes when they're sent out, which is great. Um, but yeah, I still have like another four hours for them, so that's good. Uh, now in missions, let's check this out. Um, missions, I've got my Ralph and Vanellope one finished. Success, mission accomplished. I guess they can uh, restart that for 12 hours. I don't know, it's basically the rewards, like I don't know how helpful they are, really are, but um, they're there. Anyways, I haven't really figured out what those are all for, except maybe, yeah, I actually have no idea what they're for. So that is something I'm still waiting to figure out. Boom, lots of stuff now. Now I guess the last thing I can do for the day is go ahead and power up some skills on my heroes. Now, it's really expensive now to do that for my heroes, um, just because they are so high. Oh my gosh. I like literally just use like 200,000 gold, actually over that, so that's insane. <laughs> no more! <laughs> All right, now the last thing I will do is open one more gold crate here. And I got mini XP drinks. I got 10 of them. So I'm at like 620 XP drinks. That's actually kind of impressive. I should probably use them. <laughs> All right, so that is everything I'm going to be doing for this video. Make sure you guys subscribe. Hit that little bell for post notifications. And don't forget, as always, to give this video a big, giant hero thumbs up. And we'll see you guys for the next video.